Hey guys, it's me, 80s Morphal 4, so you guys will do a quick match reaction for Iran 2, Qatar 3. Shout out to Qatar, man. They defied the odds again and managed to beat Iran 3-2 and advance to the, this year's Asia Cup final, which will be taking on Jordan in the final. Of course, guys, join me for the um, join me for the final. We're going to have our final preview later tonight, and obviously tomorrow I'll do my prediction video. So, let's start with Iran, man. I'm going to continue to reiterate this again, and we're going to continue to say this time and time again. Iran is a good team. Let's be real here. But when the time pressure gets tough, when it comes time for them to perform, these guys never perform in the high stake games. And honestly, when they had beat in Japan, I thought, okay, maybe Iran is back. But I guess it just shows you that the Japan were just terrible. And you have to give Qatar a lot of credit here because Qatar had to come from behind. Iran took the lead through Azmut, a very good bicycle kick from him. And then obviously the the, the goal equalized was um Abdu uh oh, butcher not butcher his name Abdul Salim with a fantastic goal there great great individual effort and then the forty third minute Afif man Afif scored and then it was two one and you're thinking to yourself okay can Iran get back in this game then Iran gets a penalty clear handball I think it was from Mukhtar Mukhtar gave away a penalty John Baka steps up converts a penalty and then from that point on man Iran should have um, scored more opportunities they had on um, the second half. But they didn't. Um, they only had two shots on target, and then Qatar equal Qatar scored the late winner with that Ali um, scoring there. Great, great, pa uh, great pass from Fatih there. And yeah, as I said, man. So they got the um, they got the winner, man. They got the winner. Um, sorry, Hat team got the assist. Hat team got the assist actually. Uh, then yeah, obviously Iran had some flurry of chances in the second half. Extra uh, second half, they almost hit the post. They actually hit the post, I believe, late in the game, but it wasn't to be. And Qatar moves on to this year's Asian Cup final. So from Iran, man, defensively were very poor. I thought defensively they were very, very vulnerable. And um, which was surprising because defensively they're generally pretty solid. And for Qatar, man, this is a team that never gives up. This is a team that never gives up. Barshi made some big saves um in the second half in particular, um, to de uh, to deny Iran. And Iran, man, defensively they were just terrible. Defensively, they're not good at all in this game. And Qatar just took the game to the scrub of the neck. And remember, Qatar had, like, I think 99% of the fans. Only 1% Iranian fans were there. And, yeah, you can see right here, man, Qatar were the better team. They had more shots on target. They created more dangerous opportunities. And, um, yeah, I think for Iran, man, just defensively, they were just so poor. And Taremi, man, he didn't show up in this game, man. Taremi didn't show up. I was really disappointed. I thought Taremi being back in the lineup would add some would add some flair, but ultimately didn't really do anything. And ultimately, he was a disappointment. So, for Qatar, man... Shout out to um, Amos Ali, man. He showed up in this game, man. He showed up because most of Germany, he's been pretty bad, but he scored a crucial game-winning goal, and that means so much. And obviously, Iran did go down for a 10 men. That was a very stupid challenge. He might have center back. A straight right, I believe. And yeah, man, for Iran, man, it's just disappointment, man. Really, really disappointing for them to not do this. And yeah, shout out to Qatar, man. Shout out to Qatar. So join us for the live reaction, guys, later tonight after the AFCON games are done. Um, and it'll be starting around four hours and 20 minutes. So join me for that, guys. So please remember to like and subscribe. And yeah, let me know, guys, any, uh, let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments below. And any major talking points, please let me know as well. I'm pretty sure there probably will be. All right. See you guys later, man. Peace out.